nobody fucking with me, nigga. Ain't nobody fucking with me. Ain't nobody fucking with me. Ain't nobody fucking with me. Cause I got on. Welcome back, best unit crew. It's your girl. Coming on to do some lighters. Um, using just cardstock and vinyl and mountain tape. Let's see. Um, mountain tape. Mounting tape. I'm going to be using this here. It's a double-sided uh, permanent tape paper. And I got it from Hobby Lobby for... No more than like a dollar and 24 cents. Got some lighters I got from uh, Dollar General. No, I think I got these from Family Dollars. I think they were no more than like a dollar or two. About like a dollar. I think it was like a dollar. So I got some card stock I got from Walmart. I used this once before in a video. Uh, just some glitter card stock. You can print on it. You can print on it. And. I have I have this shimmery looking paper here I got from Michaels I don't know what the packaging is for that but it comes in a pack like this it's the same name by recollection and everything this one here is a glitter uh, card stock come with like four sheets but I think I didn't use the majority of it so yeah so that's just an idea for people that like to make the glitter lighters and it's pretty glittery it looks good and I got a sheet of pink vinyl. And I, you know, I'm just going to try and just wrap a lighter and put a name and all that good stuff on it. Um, sticker paper I was using also for glitter. Just glitter sheets. I had like all different color glitter sheets. So I'm going to try to use this as a wrap method. So we're just going to play around. Nothing. Fancy. I'm just trying some stuff. I'm also going to try and bling a lighter. I couldn't find my full sheet, so I'm going to make this do what it do. But all right, let's get started. Okay, guys, my camera cut off when I got to this part here, and I can't find the file because, like, you know, it's just sucking. Anywho, let me run you down real quick on what I just did for this one. I had uh, put the mountain tape on the back of it. And then I put the vinyl on front of the glitter paper. And I'm just going to weed my name out. Just won't let it be great. And I'm while I'm doing it like this, the uh, vinyl won't come off of the uh, vinyl. It lifted all up together, so I just laid the whole piece down on here, and now I'm trying to weed it off of here. After I pulled the paper off of it, so I don't know. Like uh, like I said, the sizing for all the squares that I'm doing. Uh, 2.45 width and height and um, how I got the perfect measurements for my name to fit inside the square is I got a shape in Cricut Design Space and I put my name in it after I sized the square to 2.45 width and 2.45 height I just got my name and put it inside the square and I made sure it fit before I printed it cut it with the uh, machine so this will be the first test. So I, I, like I said, I got the mountain paper on the back. All I'm going to do is pull the paper off of it. This back part right here, if you can see. I'm just pulling this off. Okay. And I'm just going to put it on. So I'm just trying to give somebody another idea of a lighter with the glitter because I don't like messing with glitter. <laughs> so this would be a cute little idea for a glitter lighter. You see? Keep y'all from having the glitter so much if you think this pretty.
Okay, so that is one. The next step, we're gonna do it again with just the mountain tape. Just uh, we're gonna do it with the my card stop. We're gonna do it with the card stop. Okay, so all I'm going to do is just cut my image out. And like I said, every um, image, every square was 2.45 width, 2.45 height. That's what I measured it as for my lighters. Just my lighter, this kind of lighter now. Um, I got another video called uh, DIY lighters. Custom lighters or something like that. And it got the width for the the big lighters on there but you can also google you know what's what's a um, template size of a lighter and it will tell you the measurements you would need if you google it what's the regular size of a lighter template or something like that label a lighter label or something I don't know anywho so this is my mountain tape again See real good or not. It has a shiny coat on the front. Let me see. It has like a shiny coat on the front, and on the back is a dull. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna cut. I don't know, like I said, I should have put it in the cricket and like let it cut the shapes out for me. And that way I wouldn't have to do all this. But uh I just measure it with the picture that's already cut that length, and then I'm just gonna cut. But your cricket will cut it for you if you get a uh, square. And just make that square a 2.4, what, 2.45 width and height. And it'll cut it out for you. That way you already have it already cut out. So now all I'm going to do is pull this shiny for, side away from the dull. And this right here you do not need. Yeah, this is the shiny side. So now you place the sticky part onto your image and then just make sure you get it on there real good okay and we're just gonna pull the back enough like a sticker. Okay, this is the mountain tape. The mountain paper, mountain, mountain, however you see it. And then we just place it where we want it to go. There we go. Pretty. Looks real good. Yeah. And this is a glitter card stock. It looks pretty good. Or you can use like a double sided uh tape. But this is a double sided tape, but this here tapes the whole thing to the lighter. So I like this tape. This mountain tape. It's just the packaging again of the tape I'm using. It's by Paper Studios and I got it from Hobby Lobby for a dollar and twenty-four cents. So so far we made two cute little glitter lighters without making a mess. So what y'all think? Cute, right? Tell you the light ain't jumping like it should, but it is on there and it's gorgeous. And that so that lighter there, I use this paper here. You buy this from Walmart, no more than five dollars. Yeah, it's a glitter car stock, it's pretty. Okay, our next one, we're just gonna use a regular pretty paper just to you know change the color of a lighter. So, this is something I got from Michaels, I told you. It looks like the glitter cardstock paper. That's what I did this one with. And these come from Michaels. They also have this holographic looking paper too. 
Okay, so same method with the mountain tape. I'm just gonna cut, put it there and cut it. Pull the backing up, get the sticky side, and put the sticky side on your piece of paper you use. And just scrape it. Make sure it's on that good. Take it off there, place it on the lighter. And you can also put a name on there. Place it down, fold it over. Stuff everywhere. Look at that. Just that quick. What y'all think? Cute, right? You can put a name here, like I did the purple one. Okay. Another one, real quick, like I want to try to blend. A lighter. Okay. Another one we have is this bling strip. They used to come like bigger than this, like a whole sheet, like a 12 by 12 sheet almost. But I didn't use so much of this over the years. I don't know where it's at. I don't <laughs> But you can find this at Michael's. And this is already have a sticking backing on it. You can add more if you would like. But me, I'm not going to. So what I'm going to do is just cut in layers because of it's in scripts. Mine's came in scripts. But they do have a sheet that's full and you can just lay the whole sheet around and cut So I'm just going to cut that. I'm responsible for this measurement here because I don't have the whole sheet. So let me see. Let me cut this square here. Almost look like I like that. I think the shape was uneven. Okay, there. And it got like a little roll you can cut through. So they, they can help a whole lot. Okay. So we're going to try to wrap. Try to wrap it around. And like I said, they are already apart. So that's going to be the hard part. Like for real. Let me see you can see. See where I started the thing yet. And just try to get them closer and closer. Just try to get them close as you can. I forgot to pull that paper off. That's fine.
They're looking good so far. Look at that. Let me try and teach y'all not to work so hard. Yeah. Try to get it close as possible. And just wrap it around. Cut a little bit, but okay. The best thing about these here is because they got that little line. So if we get to the end and it's too long, you can just go between there and cut. That's the best part about it. Voila, it's finna, my battery about to die. <laughs> Look at that, y'all. Y'all can't tell me that's not pretty. So we got a bling. We got four different lighters just that quick. So use your imagination. You can do whatever. Y'all have a blessed one. Y'all have a great day.